We're standing in St. Martin's Church, just next to the abandoned medieval village of Warren Percy. We've got three teams on the ground tonight, one in the church, one at a nearby farmhouse, and one in the church graveyard. Join us tonight as we go Beyond the Living. Tonight we're going to undertake an incredibly specific task. Standing here in St Martin's Church we have our XLS Apparition camera. This is facing towards where the altar would have been. We are going to have one of our team in here by themselves being filmed by the XLS and by a normal camera just there in the hopes that we can catch some spirits in action. Nine. What, Meg? Here it goes. If you're a female, can you make all of these flash plays? If you're a male spirit, make all of the lights flash for me, please. Do you prefer me being sat on the floor? Make them all light up again if you like me being sat on the floor. Her battery's just dead. One it's gone. If you've just made his battery die, make them all flash for me, please. What the? So Becky's now doing a REM pod reading. And the camera, I'll just spin this camera around. The, the cameras are just completely we're currently setting up the SLS and the camera that we've got recording the SLS has just died and then as you've just heard we got the response from the REM pod that they are the ones that drained our battery my radio has just gone off yeah go ahead mate What the hell? Is this SLS just died? It, it completely. I know. I what know the... you really like these lights, but if you go over to that ball and play with that ball, there's lights on that as well. So the ball that Rebe Becky's pointed to now is actually a cat ball that you can buy at any pet shop, one that's motion censored with a set of lights in it. 
What the hell? Are you a female? Make all the lights light up if you're a female. Make them light up if you're a male. Completely gone. Completely gone. Dead. No battery. So the SLS camera is now dead. The camera that we had positioned over the SLS is dead. I've got... There's, there's no battery link. Back down. Is it easy for you to touch it here? That's crazy. I knew we'd get technical problems, but I didn't think it would be as bad as that. Make them all light up for me, please. I charged this up to over 100% before I left. It was still plugged in when I was at yours. Yeah. That's what I thought. Yeah. Make them all light up. Is it easy for you down here? Let's see if it works outside. Right, can you stop it please? Stop the light. Warren Percy Farmhouse. We're going to do an EVP session and K2. K2 is running, we'll see if it takes anything up. Is there anybody here with us? Does anybody want to come and say hello? Anybody here? Can you make the K2 lights change? I just need to go close to it. You can use our energy to do it if you need to. <laughs> Is there anybody here who wants to talk to us? Can you come far away? Well, as little as you can into the box, we'll be able to hear you. Let's talk to us. I mean, you know how. Come in love and light. Gentlemen, inside inside the building, would you like to talk to us?
in the hum. What's your name, love? What's your name, love? What's your name, love? Sensing, uh, I am sensing like a monster behind me. Struggle there. Uh, literally, watching what we're doing. If anybody here wants to talk to us? There's a man sitting around just checking out what we're doing. Would you like to come forward and tell us? There's a man sitting around just checking out what we're doing. Would you like to come forward and tell us? There's a man sitting around just checking out what we're doing. Would you like to come forward and tell us? female voice who came to stand with us and she said that she was out here. So when we came out here, um, we were, well I was drawn straight to, there you go, bear with us, I was drawn straight to this gravestone. And on this gravestone, before we'd even looked at it, we knew that that female was going to be here. And you just to clarify what that said on temperature at the bottom. Okay. So we're going to ask Elizabeth <laughs> if she can come and talk to us, please. And that would be lovely. If she can talk into this spirit box, or she can come and say hello. To Natalie, or to me, to Donna, and if you could speak into the spirit box, that would be lovely. Far as please, or alternatively, you can come through with this little box here. That would be even better. And if you can move that temperature gauge for me, that would be marvellous. I'm just going to put that to do now. There we go. So if you can come and yeah, talk to us, please. We also have a male here as well. 
Is that correct? That's correct. So if you can come up here with these temperature gauges for me, I'll come really, really close. That would be lovely. That one's really good. Yeah. Yeah. You see? <coughs> yeah. And if you could bring a female voice through on the spirit box for me, please. That's the scanning thing. Or technically. <laughs> or if you can, come on hold my listening for me. That would be lovely. Or you might not want to come and talk to us. any children? Can you do the click again for us? Please. Thank you. Can you do the click again for us? Please. Thank you. Can you do the click again for us? Please. Thank you. Thank you. So we do know that's you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> and thank you for saying thank you. I think that's what you said. Is that correct? Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, okay. Elizabeth. Did she answer how many children she had? Hmm? Did she answer how many children she had? I think she said two. <laughs> yeah. 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 Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> Just confirming it. Thank you. I think she said two. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> Just confirming it. Thank you. I think she said two. <laughs> yes. Yeah. yeah. Thank you, Elizabeth. <laughs> Just confirming it. Thank you. You yeah, that voice again as well. Um, this temperature gauge here is like really quiet. So, Elizabeth, if you can come in and around this machine. Yeah, that's me. Okay. And I know the battery is running really low. Yeah. <laughs> but if you could come in and around that, please, that would be lovely. Yeah, I think it's doing something like yeah. Okay, William, can you come in and make it even colder for us? And um, what did you have to do with the house, the farmhouse? Do we know if they had something to do with that farmhouse? What did you have to do with the house, the farmhouse? Do we know if they had something to do with that farmhouse? What did you have to do with the house, the farmhouse? Do we know if they had something to do with that farmhouse? They've not looked into anything. Okay. I think Joe knows a bit more. Right, we'll have to ask him then because um, the gentleman that followed us down when I was walking through the door, um, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's William. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay. We'll ask him about that. Alright. Um, but I can tell you, he must have liked um, horses that are riding um, because he had um, what looked to me like a a uh, pair of like men's riding boots on. That's really strange because we were talking about yeah, horse riding when we were walking like between the farmhouse okay. and the church. So you understand where that comes in then? Right, and it came out of nowhere that conversation. When you mentioned riding boots, 
yeah. the machine kit twice as well. Okay. And the farm. Um, I know that. Well, I don't know, but my, uh, yeah. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, Elizabeth. Is this right in saying that there were other farm houses that were owned around here, please? Does that mean yes? Can we click for yes? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Can we click for yes? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Can we click for yes? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is this correct in saying that that church over there is built on another church that was far older, please? That's the place. Yeah. And where would that that church go back to? Is it the 10th, the 11th, the 12th, the 13th, the 14th century? 15th, 15th, 15th century. 15th, 15th century. 15th, 15th century. 15th century. Okay. Uh, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 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 If I walk towards it, is this the one you want us to walk to? No. I'm standing here now, is this the one you want me to walk to? Can you make a ticking noise if you want us to move to where Donna is? Yes, I do. Can. I just say light. Yeah. What, is the light too bright? I have literally just turned it up. The light. The light. I just say light. We'll go straight then. Okay, going straight. We're going straight. What did you say? Can you say that again? Straight. That way. Yeah, I think we do. Where? The one in front of you? In front, in front, this one. This Where? That's a female voice. Busy. That's a female voice. Busy. That's a female voice. This is all right now. Is <laughs> <laughs> that it there? Um, I think you might have to move your lights away or fill them down a bit.
Yeah, then dry it down. Yeah. Did you see that guy in the face? I thought that was just me. Might have just been. Might have just been on. Oof. No, it moved. Yeah, it moved. moved. Yes, it moved. Can you move that there again for me, please? Did it move? That would be lovely if you could do that again. I know we'll have it on camera. Yeah, thank you. I know I've given you a lot of things to do. You don't have to fiddle around with the lights, that's okay. Yeah. But that bear's got lights on it. So, yeah. So somebody wants to move it, I'll make those lights blow for me. That would be lovely. Do you know I've got a camera? Actually, yeah. they've the wall on gone. Are they? Yeah, because yeah. when yeah. Yeah, when um, Katie moved, it's the camera. There you go. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. 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 It did move, didn't it? Yeah. Did, yeah. And it was settled. And yeah. then when I said it moved, it actually moved backwards. It went literally, it went. Yeah, that's the thing that's going to let my lights go. No, it's alright. My lights go. No, it's alright. Alright, go. No, it's alright. Yeah, if you can move that bear again, that would be lovely. We did see you do it. That's a cliff. Okay. I promise we will go and have a look for those on that grave. Mary. Mary. <laughs> Mary. Mary. <laughs> Mary. 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 <laughs> yeah. And um, I brought George because um, he knew that we're your children. Yeah. Um, where your, your your babies are concerned. I'm very sorry that they didn't get to. Um, a better age. It's been very, very sad for you. There was a boy on there, wasn't there? Yeah. Matt. Yeah. Okay. So was it the boy that touched the bear? Yeah. Can he come back and do that again for us? No. <laughs> that was less than five boys. Yeah. 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 Thank you. I know we can't really see the lights shining, but I know they are. Yeah. What do you want to do now? Yeah, I know. It's not loud to do it when you do it, yeah, yeah, yeah. The camera was pointing at it. Yeah. You didn't even have to see it in the car. No. I know. There's no absolutely no wind either. I know. No. It looked like somebody took it. Yeah. yeah. There you go. <laughs> yeah, okay. We're only just checking everything out. That's no, why I said it again. It moved. It moved backwards. Yeah. We're like tilted backwards. Yeah. At first it went like that. Yeah. Then it went then back it again. Yeah. Back back again. Yeah. yeah.
So, can you point to the gravestone where the children are, please? Yeah, there. Okay, and can you point to where Mary is coming, please? Mary, yes. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. That's lovely. Thank you very much. And can you point back to where the children are for me, please? There. Can you find me the unmarked grave? In that direction. Is that correct? Can you put them in a cross or cross them over if that's correct? Yeah. Big across would be lovely. Yeah, thank you. So you want me to go that way? That way. <laughs> I think that might be a that way, guys. Okay, just to make sure we test this out. Guys, can you, um, lovely Mary and Elizabeth and what else we've got? Point the wall for something. Yeah, okay, that's a lot of Okay, so can you make a cross if that's correct? Cross the stick. Yeah, thank yeah. you. Okay. Yeah, I can hear you on the boot boxes now. Okay, so can you point to where the unmarked grave are, please? That way. Is that correct? That way. Okay. So when I come anywhere closer to where these are not good, yeah? You know where we're going to do it, yeah? Okay. not on that, so... Daz is now going to do a spirit box session in the St Martin's Church to see what we can get. Is anybody here with us right now? Can you come through and let me know who you are?
Can you say that again for me? And just picked up a female voice. Good shit, very fair. within these church walls or within the grounds of Warren Percy can you tell me if you're here with us right now Yes or no answer will be fine. Or would you like to give her as a message? Give us some indication that you are here. Are you one of the monks that live here? as if something's trying to come through but it's not strong enough have enough energy you can use my energy or just or crates if you wish um, just to communicate with the spots just a little bit just to let us know that you're there Switch the AM now. Can you uh, communicate in this for me? Can you uh, communicate in this for me? Can you uh, communicate in this for me? Shiny lights to come out again. By shiny lights, we mean the REM pod. Can get the REM meter out again. Would you like that? Just tell me yes or no if you'd like me to get the shiny lights out again to communicate using that. Right, I want to switch the spirit box off now. Otherwise I'm just getting it through. Okay, just make that stop, please. 
If you're here with me now, just make those lights stop. Just so I know that you're here, can you just make those lights go off again? Take your time. One more time for me, please. Just make those lights just go off one more time for me. Take them up to the, the yellow, the blue, or the red for me. Let me know that you're here. Just to let you know those voices you can hear in the background of the other team in the graveyard. There's no windows left in the church, so it's just open spaces, so that's why we can hear them. I don't think he wants to stop. He likes the little lights. Right, can you make that stop now, please? Thank you. Can you come and hold my hand on my right side? Is that a no? Would you like to go over and touch Becky's hand? Touching the silver antenna again. Are you holding Harry's hand for me? I'm going to put the other hand on the antenna. Let me know that you're here. They've gone cold again. Taunting. Give me a little bit of a prayer. The thing is, my left hand's freezing cold, my right hand's warm. Right Is that warm. Curious? Yeah, your hands yeah, have you gone back down to an eight. eight. Yeah. No, I'm just picking up on the, the child I'm going on about. Um, I believe it, it was. Uh, Autistic. Autistic? Yeah. Did you have some kind of um, learning difficulty um, when you were growing up? Did you not understand much? No, it's quite the opposite. You understood a lot, but it's just yeah, people didn't understand his behaviour. People around you not understand you. And it makes... Did you get along with the rest of the children that you were around? Got pain in the back. Ooh. Got pain in the back. That's pain not pain. Pain. Pain about pain in the back as well. Yeah. I mean, I got it from there, and then it's there. So, um, do have, is there anyone else here, like uh, another spirit, like maybe you know, another male? Or female? Is your mum and dad here? We'll just say for the benefit of the camera as well that random pains are often associated with paranormal phenomenon as a way of communication. Little man, were you the one that just gave Harry a little shot shunt in the back? It feels like someone's put pressure on the back there. It's not my fine. Right. Interesting. It's a bit like when we were up at Raincliffe Woods and yeah. you were getting so much attention from kids, weren't we? Yeah. Alright, do you want to stop, Matt? Come on. 
You having fun here? Oh. You want to stop? And I'll ask you some more questions. Come on. I know you like the colours. Okay, thank you. Could you tell me which century you're in? Which century you're from? If I pass that going through them. And you tell me when it's the right one, okay? Okay, can we stop? Thank you. So we've got 1200? 1300? Okay, where are you working now? 1400? 1500? Yeah, 1500. Okay. So that'd be about right. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Thank you for that. We really appreciate it. So the, the medieval village was abandoned in the early, the late 1200s, early 1300s, but the church was used until the early 1600s. Okay. By the local villages. Okay. So just confirm that. Okay. Okay, do you want to start that again, darling? Thank you. Hey, what's all that? There's a cheeky one, this one. You don't get much time to play, do you? With other people. No. Okay. With your family nearby? Are they buried here? Okay. Are you buried here? I'm not buried. You are? Okay. Thank you. All right, darling. Can you stop that now? Thank you. Right, come on. It's like a plate. Yeah. Alright. Find a lot of the child spirits like to Are play with the lights. Are you happy here? I don't mean to do that. I've just recorded that as well. <laughs> so we have, a, we have a spirit box sitting in the middle of the graveyard. If one of the girls can just ask it a few questions and see if we can get any kind of communication through the device. Is there anybody here with us that would like to come forward and talk? If you could speak into this box, we'll all be able to hear your voice. We'd really appreciate that. Maybe come forward and tell us your name. And if you'd be able to tell us whether you are a male or a female. Or how many spirits are with us right now. We'd really appreciate you coming forward and speaking to us. point in the graveyard you prefer us to be at to make it easier to communicate with you. Harry, there was a fairy. Go back into the church. Just go in my bag. So there's some little EVPs. Yeah, hey, grab, grab, grab one. Will you? Batteries are on the back, I think. Have we got one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mary. Mary with three children. Uh, Elizabeth, 
so good. I'm just leaning on the gravy. I know the empty, but... If Mary or Elizabeth are still here with us, I'd like for you to come through, maybe talk to the guys that weren't here with us earlier when we spoke to you. I might be better off moving towards that way that we spoke. You've got a lot of activity a bit further over. Yeah. Yeah. And we'd like to get a bigger one. Yeah. 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 Oh, it's very cold. Okay, come back over here. See if we can talk to you again, Elizabeth. Because some of the guys weren't here earlier when we spoke to you. I appreciate it. it takes a lot of energy for you to come towards us. So feel free to use our energy. And just come through and say hi to us. Or if there's any other spirits that would like to come forward and speak to us. earlier but I don't think we didn't really ask her anything about is it you that's talking to telling Craig this at the moment Elizabeth or is it William is that how William died Break out the. Uh, we we'll only just put it down and it's yeah. going a little bit crazy. Yeah, they went crazy for the lights last time. Some more wee things. Is <coughs> that. Can you make that stop? Just make that light stop, please. Thank you very much. Is it Elizabeth that's with us? Yeah? Okay, lovely. Thank you. Now, Craig had a feeling that he'd been stabbed. Yeah? Okay, thank you. Is that how you died, Elizabeth? Is that how William died? Yeah. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. Every time I think of a question, it starts going on. to do with a robbery. Robbery? So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. Can you. Just make that light stop. It's 
make them stop for me. Just take it all the way back down. Thank you. So William was stabbed during a robbery. Yeah. Okay, thank you very much. Was it during that robbery that you died as well? No, you lived past that robbery. Can you confirm whether you died after William then? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Was that due to depression or sadness? That you felt alone? Interesting. Died of a broken heart. Yeah. Is that true? Did he die of a broken heart? Elizabeth, did you die of a broken heart after William died? No. No. No, I think... Elizabeth, was it something to do with your stomach? Your stomach pains? Yeah. You picked up on that earlier, didn't you? That's interesting, because it's just gone yellow, and it's stayed a yellow. Mm. That's... You've been very gentle with it. Yeah. Those are straight answers. Yeah. Can you can you just so we can clarify that you are talking to us? Can you just make the light go blue for me? Next one. Next one up from there. If you can take it up to blue, it just confirms that you're here. and appreciate it does take a lot of energy yeah can you take that light up to the next one feel free to use our energy can you take it up to yellow or is this not Elizabeth anymore We are still speaking to Elizabeth. There's a gentleman coming around in a minute. What's the gentleman called? Are you getting in there? He's saying John. Is it John that we've now got with us? Joseph, wasn't it? Uh, yeah, Joseph. I can't remember. John, can you make those lights go up to red for me? I don't think we've come across the John yet. You take it all the way to the top. One big jump. Thank you. Thank you. We did ask the other. Yeah. We did. So is it John that's with us now? That's who we're speaking to. Yeah? Okay, thank you. And John, were you buried in this graveyard? Is somebody you love buried in this graveyard? Was, Eli well, sorry. Was Elizabeth your sister? Or a good close friend within the village? Or did you know her through the church?
Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah, that's it. He's putting it through on me, he's trying to get through though. I'm asking the guys not to. It's not a good idea. That's a confirmation we've got a blue light, guys. Which means it's got a cold atmosphere around it. Okay, thank you. So you died of a breathing difficulty? Was it due to cold weather? No. It wasn't, it wasn't the breathing that, ki that killed him. No, no. It was, it was something to do with the heart. Die of a heart complication? Something in your chest? It seems a bit all over the place. So yeah. I feel like we're a bit distraught as well. Forty, I believe. Are you in your forties, John? Can you confirm that by? Letting the lights go off. Early forties. I think he wanted to come through me and I won't let him and that's why he's not responding. Yeah. Okay, did you say something about breathing? Yeah. Do you remember Katie when we were down with Mary? Donna picked up and said something about breathing. Oh, so I don't know if this is Ma maybe Mary, I don't know. But she picked up on breathing that somebody had a breathing problem. That was to do with Mary, Mary. Yeah. Mm. They could come on one spirit that's coming <coughs> through trying to get to me. Feel like that? Yeah. 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 What you can hear him like the galloping? No, I feel like the, the walking down down this hill. After a long, cold night of investigating at Warren Percy, we brought you some fantastic footage from the teddy bear, from our EVPs, and from our spirit box sessions. We hope you've enjoyed this episode. Please make sure to like, subscribe, comment below, share with your friends, and follow us for more Beyond the Living.